You know, um, there, there are several things I would ask him. I've been concerned about this last legislative uh, session, and I hear different things. I hear some from some groups, nothing got done. I hear from others, yes, we were able to do some things. I'm concerned about, from the conservative viewpoint, I'm concerned about the p potential of us losing the House. I don't want us to lose the House from the Republican side. And so those, I would gear my questions towards that. Okay, and then um, what about his performance do you like or dislike, just generally speaking? You know, I, I've, been a, I've been a fan uh, of the governor, uh, and I'm, uh, I want to make sure that they stay and, and adhere to the conservative values that they've held for so long. And so um, they say all politics is local. Some political observers also say Texas is turning purple. What does that mean for you and other Republicans at the local grassroots, grassroots level? Well, you know what? That is a that is a frightening thing. I think I think that's what I was addressing a while ago with the state. Is are we are we blending? You know, the Republican and the Democrats. And I'm concerned about that. We need to stay staunch with our conservative values, there's always a time that you have to give and take. There's always that time where you have to move. If you're so far right that you can't say, hey, we're not going to progress if we all sit on our ideas and we're not willing to bend and talk and, and maneuver that way. So that would be my concern. As far as locally is concerned, I don't see it as much locally here in Smith County or Tyler, I, I, but on the state level, yes, and we care about that.